Here we come. Yeah. It's the bald and the beautiful. They know all about you. Everything from Nashville to Hollywood on My Country 96.1. Candy, we start with Leanne Rhymes, who had some precancerous cells removed uh, from her cervix. She is fine. They caught, you know, this is like a, yeah. a, a new thing that they do to, to, to really see what's going on, you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Why we uh, have to know this, I don't know. Yeah, well, you know, she uh, it, it was it was reported. It was in an article, and she actually said, you know, January not so great. Uh, uh, last couple of Januarys, she had dental work and lost her voice. Oh, so mm-hmm. January's not kind to her. No, but um, a lot of women getting uh, this, pr- like, like getting these tests done that show, like, they don't have cancer, but they show these precancerous right. cells. You know, mm-hmm. yes. Um, and it's amazing. Technology is just amazing. It um, really is. Let's uh, live long and yeah. be healthy. Saving lives. Um, and she's fine. Everything's good. Uh, Joe Don Rooney uh, had a panic attack. You know, we told you about Joe Don a little while back, maybe last week. Um, he is, uh, you know, a recovering alcoholic. He was talking about different things going on in his life, his uh, DUI and all these things. Uh, the guitar player from Rascal Flats also uh, said he had a panic attack recently on a plane. They landed in Nashville, but they were stuck on the tarmac for three hours. Oh, that's the worst. Yeah, and he talked uh, all about it. Crazy. Mm-hmm. Uh, and NBA star Jimmy Butler, if you know his kind of backstory, he is very close with a lot of country stars. He loves country music. Um, he's actually working on a country album, he says. He has about 200 songs to choose from, to record right now. That's quite a number of songs. Yeah, wish him luck with that, absolutely. Yes, yes, sir. Uh, Congrats to Josh Dumel and his wife. They welcomed their first child. Now, he's got a 10-year-old with Fergie, as you may recall. Yes, he does, yes. But congrats, he and his wife, his current wife. Do you know what they had, a boy or a girl? I knew you were going to ask, and I looked, and it did not say what they had. Oh, too bad. Yeah. Uh, Jason Kelsey from the Eagles retiring, Candy. I saw that. I feel for him. Jason Kelsey, very emotional on the field. Very. very. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, But listen, you know, he's been with the same team, the Eagles, since 2011 when he first started in football. That's Mm. a long run. He's 36. He's got a lot of money, a lot of property. He's invested in real estate. He's got three daughters. I mean, he's got a lot to be happy about, but it's kind of, you know, it's very emotional. I wish Hmm. him the very best. Someone's been doing research on Jason Kelsey. I listen to their new heights. I know everything there is to know. Yes, the podcast. Mm -hmm. Uh, Travis was giving him a hard time yesterday, making him cry, by the way. Uh, What? Well, he was making fun of the fact that the Eagles lost, and yeah, the brothers were going at it a little bit. Uh, Candy... Huge news here. Uh, Coachella released their lineup for April, you know, the big uh, uh, festival in California. And Gwen Stefani with her band, no doubt, are reuniting at Coachella. Oh, I love that. I mean, huge news. That would make me want to go. They must have gotten an offer they couldn't refuse. They were so good, really so good. Yeah, well, uh, love let's, no doubt. Love. They were great. They were a huge, great, big '90s band. But let's just let's let's go back to my comment for a second. They would not be reuniting if someone didn't sit down and say, "Here's what we're offering you." It must have been a large sum of money to uh, get on stage. Well, thank at Coachella. whoever did that because yep. we look forward to them getting back together for sure. Yep, yep. gonna be uh, gonna be fun. Uh, DMC from Run DMC, Daryl McDaniels, has a cookie company, and it's called DMC, which stands for Daryl Makes Cookies. Oh, what kind of cookies is he making? I don't, you know, why'd you have to ask me that? I don't know. I'm so sorry. (laughs) Uh, Candy, the sad news from a number of days ago, uh, when Alex Musser of All My Children passed away, um, it was uh, noted yesterday that he did take his own life. Very sad. So sad. I'm so, so sorry to hear that, really. And a lot of people will know Alex Musser 
if they're not soap opera fans, from the Adam Sandler film Grown Ups, which is on TV all the time. Alex Musser played the lifeguard at the water park. It, it, it was like a two-minute roll, but it was a big, big moment in the film. Uh, and very sad news, Ken. Very sad. Very yeah. sad. I hate to hear news like that. Uh, the movie Dune will be back in theaters February 18th and 19th for the 40th anniversary. Mm. Yeah, never saw it, by the way. Me either. Me either. And Michael Buble says he was almost attacked by a polar bear on a beach in Canada. Now, I don't have the story. I just see the headline. Uh, all I can think about is he's lucky he wasn't attacked by a polar bear. That would be bye-bye Buble, Candy. Bye-bye Buble. Um, yeah, they're vicious. They yeah. are. I think they're one of the most vicious bears, uh, but they have a hard life, so I'm giving them a break. Well, you know, the. I don't know if this uh, holds true, but they, they say, uh, as far as bears go, if it's a black, fight back. If it's brown, lay down. And if it's white, good night. Good night. <laughs> 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 you got no shot against the polar bear. Yeah, mm -mm. yeah, they're a little uh, nasty. Yeah, TV uh, tonight, NBC with the premieres of Chicago Med, ninth season, Chicago Fire, 12th season, and Chicago PD, 11th season. Fox, I Can See Your Voice, and CBS, Price is Right at Night. And there you have it, your bald and the beautiful entertainment, everything from Nashville to Hollywood, uh, we are looking at cold temperatures, some icy roads. Uh, we will only get up to 27. Sunshine, oh. though. We got oh. sun, all right? It's going to feel chilly. Uh, the temperatures could feel single digits at times, but 27 for the high today. Tomorrow, a mix of sun and clouds and about 30. Let's hit the roads. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country, 96.1.